Hey guys, we're here and welcome back to SnowRunner episode 7. We're here today, well, I haven't really worked out what we're going to be doing. Well, yeah, I remember the, the uh, 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 trailer. Where is that trailer? It's like way back here, isn't it? There's a trailer stuck in the mud somewhere. Not far from the garage. Oh, where was it? Did we already get it? That's the trailer that we have there. Hang on. Where is the Riverside Repair Stack Trailer? Alright, oh, it's way over here. That's really like super, super stuck. But hey, thanks to the previous episode, we got a brand new truck that's going to probably do this thing like it's no, no problem at all. It's going to pull this thing out like there's no issues at all. The only problem is, well, even if I don't have the proper hook for the trailer, I can just winch the thing and pull it that way. So we gotta get all the way over there. Oh, okay, I don't know how we get there. I now know how we get there. We have to go this way. And through this way. All the way up the road. All the way up across the bridge. All the way over here and then all the way over the water this way to the gas station. All the way over there. And then we can probably accept the mission along the way past there. Then you have to go further up the road, way up past the trailer, up to this part of the road here, past these rocks there, and then get here, then where we can get into here. Down to the trailer, stuck in the mud. So yeah, a trip and a half, but eh, we'll get there. We can get there, not a problem. In a brand new truck, let's leave the garage, start her up, park and brake. Oh, all the dogs are always on, and the flock is always on on this thing. Let's unequip the fucking brake, and here we go! Okay! Alright, I can change the time of day. What time of day is it currently? It's 16, let's make it 6 in the morning! Ah, it's much better. Okay! Run this amazing truck and just absolutely go and destroy the mud with this thing. Sure, it's not the fastest thing in the world, but oh well. At least it's really, really good. Even though it's got the crappy horn, but hey. I'll drive along and I'll catch you guys up if I... Well, I'm not if, when I get into town. There we go. Right, so I've made it. I'm close to the gas station. And this thing just... It just goes through that. Only has four gears. I've only made it, made it to this area now. I feel like I've been driving for the, like what, five minutes? This thing, like I said, is not the fastest thing in the world. I don't even know if I'm going for 55 miles an hour. I can't really see what speeds are going out here. No digital thing here.
But we are taking three liters of fuel a minute. We have now made it into the town. The mission is just up ahead. Like I said, because you use the winch, pull that trailer out of there and pull it back to, well, I guess the mission area. That's my only guess. I kind of want to do a brightness readjustment real quick. There we go. Things should be looking a little bit better. Excuse me, cones, I got places to be. And trailers to pull out a thick mud of water, whatever the case is. Alright. Here's our mission. Let's accept it real quick. Show the task. Okay, so they lost the trailer and they want us to bring it back. Yeah, that's the trailer that's stuck. Alright, so we gotta bring it back over there. Gotcha. So we gotta drag it all the way back here. That's our mission for the day. Getting that stuck trailer out of a situation and back over there. Oh, mud coming up. This thing just eats through it. Yeah, this thing just eats it. Oh, no way. This thing's great. Good investment. This thing's definitely worth your time. Sure, it costs a lot, you gotta do a little bit of work for it, and all the things I did to get this thing, but hey, so worth it. Okay, the last dog trailer is over that way somewhere. And there's a trailer we used, uh, I don't remember what was it, like remove something from on the road? I think so. I should go on one episode and find all the trailers, take them. Well, I don't know. I don't know if selling them all would be a good idea. Because sure, they'll be around. But. What if we have, we need, like a, for example, let's say a fuel trailer is out in the middle of, the, middle of nowhere and we are close to it. We could just get fuel. If we sell that, that fuel won't be there in case we need it and then we'd be doomed. Well, anyways, while we are on our way, oh, and the trailer's right down this way. Well, while we're on our way down to the trailer, if you guys missed the first episode or the previous episode, of snow runner you can go to the, the beginning of the video there will be two cards popping up there you can click on those if you're interested there's also a whole bunch of links in the description one link will take you to the snow runner playlist two others will take you to my facebook pages and one other link will take you to my website if you are interested they are in the bottom of the description okay so we got a back up in this watery muddy mess I get that trailer And pull it out! This thing just goes. No problem. Back up, back up, back up. Winch! Attach the winch. My rear to the front of the trailer. Pull it a little bit closer. 
Does it bustle as if it's hooked to my truck? Can I actually, like, hold up? Can I actually attach the trailer? I can! I don't need to worry about the winch! Ah, oh, perfect! Forward! Through the stick mud! Ay, 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 Come on! Oh! I might need to go low range for this. But still, this truck, it keeps moving. Even though it gets slightly stuck in the mud, this thing just, it just keeps going. Doesn't matter what's in the way. Alright, now that we are out of that mess, we can go to automatic gears again and pull the trailer along. Right, parking brake. We need to bring that trailer all the way back. So we gotta get ourselves up here, go back this way to this area, and then it is, yes, it's. it's over this way, straight past the trailer again. Down into wherever we need to leave the trailer off. Perfect. Man, my stutter can get really in the way sometimes. Ah well. Doesn't happen all the time. It's permanent. Like, primarily when I want to, like, speak fast. Oh, why? Oh, well. Back onto the road we go, and let's get this trailer back to where it needs to be. That trailer is bouncing. That trailer is bouncing. <laughs> uh, it looks like a fun ride back there. <laughs> uh. Can't imagine sitting on that trailer and it's bouncing like that. <laughs> I think that'd be nuts. Avoid the wall, please. I don't want to hit the. Uh, didn't want to hit the wall, but it's fine. It's only three damage. Okay, past the trailer. On to the final straight. This trailer is bouncing like crazy. Another mission we might get to in that time. I don't know when or what that mission is, but we'll get to it maybe one day. Unless that's a timed trial mission. We won't do those. I've also, like, a long time ago, I've seen, like, what's the, like, hardest mission in SnowRunners? I'll see if I'll do it. I'll definitely try, maybe. My turn, ma'am! Whichever I got you, your trailer! And... Dunzo! 248 XP and a thousand six hundred dollars in the bag. Nice! Alright.
Question is, now what? Well, we got there's the task givers, yeah. Except for that, that, that one there. Where is it? We're not going to be doing the time dimensions, like I said. You can just do them over and over, but we got to do a lot more things out here. Keep in mind, these are just the small tasks. We got to take care of these things here, which is actually our main missions. They are big missions. They're like, put like, the big thing across the entire area like this, and like, well, I'm not, I don't want to spoil anything. Just hoping we'll never have to use that one road in the other map. No, this is an absolute mess. Um, when like one of these missions got like so many like smaller tasks beneath them, it's gonna take us a while to do these things. But first and foremost, the tiny little tasks like Riverside Repair, Local Entertainment, the place beyond the spruces. I actually know. I think I know that mission. That's gonna be easy. Missing machinery. <laughs> we'll see what happened there. Drainage is a bit of a pain. King of the Hill. Oh, that's the one I think I. Yep, yep. That's the one I was thinking of. That's an easy one right there. Pardon the passing bike. And then Motel Woes over here, which is actually just down the road from the garage. It should be no problem at all. And we'll see, as long as we do any of these, then we'll be fine. Let's see, where are we currently? Right over here. Is there any upgrades, anything I can nick real quick? There's one all the way over there. Well, that's not nearby. Oh well, that's fine. We did what we set out to do. Let's go ahead and recover. Back to the garage. Things all set and ready. All right then. Here we go. Easy, and no, no other truck except for this thing can pull that trailer out of where that thing was. Like, I'm not this safe, but I have just to plan my own for the fun of it. <laughs> Things, uh, yeah, they're rough. Like, not even the truck you, you get at the beginning, it doesn't matter what you get in the early game stage, you're not pulling that thing out of there. Of course, I know this is the only, only thing I can do, and I'm sure there's some other things that can pull that trailer out of there without a problem, but... As you've just seen, this thing can definitely do it. So definitely would recommend this truck if you haven't played this game yet. Or you're just starting out or whatever or whatnot. So let's see, like... We got the whole Black River, Michigan, New USA to do all this. What if I click on one of these? Yeah, see, like this one mission here's got all those tasks below are things we have to do. And you see that little globe icon right there next to that one there, the winter stores? Yeah, that is a whole other store on its own. It won that that would I would imagine the winter stores. I'd imagine it wanted us to drive out of Alaska using No wait. The winter stores. Oh I don't know where the winter stores would be, but I would imagine it would be like perhaps in Smithfield Dam. Then we would have to drive out to Smithfield Dam and then oh Get something from there, drive with the trailer all the way back to wherever it wants. I could imagine that that's something like that. That we will have to do with those. Because all these fuel odor, lumber mode revival. Oh. <laughs> There's a lot to do. 
This is absolutely tons to do. And then I gotta do this one too, which is not a problem. Not, not that much, but it's got two travel locations. And this one. Actually, ticked off a few of these already. Hmm. That's fine. I mean, if that wasn't enough. I didn't mean to skip time. I want to access the global map. Oh, there's more locations there, DLCs. Woo! Yeah, they're DLC stuff. We will only worry about Michigan, Alaska, and Russia time here. So, that's yeah, fine. But these areas here, Michigan's got its own three sets of missions. Alaska's got its own sets of three big missions. And so does Time Here. They all have their own, like, big missions like these. I believe. So, it's gonna be rough, but... We shall get all those things done. Just like there was on our task list, which uh, I forgot where that was. Like where that was located. The codex? Uh, forgot how you find that thing there, but that's alright. Isn't it? Layer, oh yeah, layer profile. Contracts and tasks. All these things we will have to do. That's Michigan alone. Michigan. <laughs> and then. Oh, wait, this is all. This is. See all those? We'll get to them all eventually. Okay, no, 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 that's fine. They are only for these. They're not. I thought for a moment that this list included the bad DLC stuff, but no, it doesn't. It's only Michigan, Alaska, and Time Here. Oh boy, we've only done 20% of this game. <laughs> but hey, like I said, we'll get to all these. And like I just said, if you guys can see the first episode on a previous episode of SnowRunner, you guys can go to the beginning of the video. There will be two cards popping up there. You can click on those if you're interested. There's also a whole bunch of links in the description. One link will take you to the SnowRunner playlist. Two others will take you to my Facebook pages. And one other will take you to my website if you are interested. They are in the bottom of the description. And so, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, share it if you really liked it. Comment, subscribe if you wish. And I shall see you guys in the next video. Peace out.